Helen, big welcome to Crawley. How happy are you to get the deal done on deadline day? I'm buzzing. Um, obviously, there's been a lot of talk, but to finally get it done, I'm, I'm really happy with. Tell us a little bit about how the move came about. You know, when did you sort of first hear the interest? Because obviously, we sit here right now. We've, we've only got an hour and 50 minutes till yeah. deadline day closes, but I'm sure, obviously, you spent most of the day travelling as well, haven't yeah. you? Yeah, there was a um, bit of a conversation yesterday. Um, it was quite short notice, really, to be fair. It was kind of get yourself here as quick as I can. Obviously, I travelled today. Uh, to get myself here, but no, um, like I said, I'm happy to get it done. Yeah, and what made you decide that Crawley was the, you know, the right step for you after, you know, you've left Mansfield? I just think it was the the right move for me, really. Um, come and play football. It's, that's all I want to do is just play football. So um, when this came, this opportunity came about, I was kind of buzzing, really, and I was just like, yeah, look, get me here and let's get cracking. Yeah, obviously, you would have spoken to our new manager, Scott Lindsay. Obviously, he's had his first game in charge. What were your sort of first impressions like with him? He seems sound, you know, he's, he seems like a, a good guy, so I'm, I'm looking forward to working with him. Yeah, and obviously you've got plenty of EFL experience, obviously we've already touched a little bit about your your time with Mansfield, you know, so what do you think you can bring to the side, you know, channeling that experience in, I guess? I think I can bring, you know, pace and, and stuff like that, and I've obviously I've been around this league for a, quite a while now, so I feel like I can, I can add a little something to the team, like I say, in my pace, and I feel like I'm direct, I feel like I can bring that to the team. Yeah, and I'm sure fans would have obviously naturally done their own research when they hear about the signing. Just talk us a little bit through like your time with Mansfield, because obviously when they do the research, they would have seen that you've you know you've played a lot on the right side, haven't you? You've you know you've done your wing back duties, you've sort of moved even higher than that, and then yeah. more recently you've sort of settled more into the right back role. You know, out of those three, where would you say is the most comfortable position for you? Um, I would like to say I feel like I'm a, I'm a direct player, so I can I feel like I can offer a lot going forward. So. Probably more so in the in the attacking areas, um, but at the end of the day, wherever the gaffer wants me to play, I'll play there and and do my best that I can. Yeah, I suppose obviously for you, it's just about wanting to get out there, you know, sort of prove yourself to the gaffer, and you know, as you say, wherever you wherever you are put, you will play, I guess. Yeah, that, that, that literally you hit the nail on the head there. It's wherever he wants me to play, I'll play, and I just gotta do what I can. Yeah, obviously. It was a day off for you today, obviously you spent the whole day travelling. Yeah. We have a day off tomorrow on a Wednesday, Thursday is your first opportunity to meet the lads. We were speaking just briefly before, you already know Dylan Conroy. We, yeah. we often bring these up in these first interviews. You know, how much does it help already knowing you know, someone as you come into a new club? I think it always helps. Um, obviously it was a long time ago I was at Swindon with Dion, uh, so I haven't seen him in a while, but it's always nice to have a friendly face and someone that you do know. And I did actually get on with him while I was at Swindon, so yeah, it'd be, it'd be good to see him. And yeah, obviously it'd be good to meet the rest of the lads as well. Yeah, and I suppose he's only passed on, you know, good information on the new manager, you know, Scott Lindsay, having come from Swindon himself. So yeah. I'm sure that's, you know, that's a real help for you as well. Like I say, it's always a help knowing somebody and I'm sure I'll, I'll have a conversation with Dion and obviously, like I say, get to know the rest of the lads as well. A very exciting game for us on Saturday. You could be thrown straight into the deep end. We head to the Priestfield Stadium to take on Gillingham. You know, sold out away and sold out home, and it's you know it's gonna be a crack. And I'm I'm sure if you could pick any game, that would be one of the first ones. A good local derby. I think it'll be a brilliant game. To be fair, I played there early in the season for Mansfield, and it was a good atmosphere there, just uh, with Mansfield. So never mind as a like say a local derby. I think it'll be a great game to be involved in. Hopefully, Kellen, welcome to Crawley. Thank you very much.